Tied to a wheel. Anyway, awful attempt at playing that song. Anyway, let's talk about Bush and their new record. Um, um, what's it called? The the artist the artist survival. I don't know if that's a COVID reference. Um, probably not, but it kind of might be. I'm I'm not 100 percent sure. Um, I'm actually really ashamed of myself that it took me this long to make a video uh, because the record came out um, on October the 7th and now it's October the 15th so I'm pretty much like a week behind which I am like genuinely ashamed of <laughs> um, being one of their biggest fans I should have made a record or a video literally like the hour it was released but it's kind of been a it's kind of been a weird couple of weeks for me and to be honest with you I don't I'm not gonna I, I wanted to originally do a a book them being my favorite band I kind of wanted to do like a Bush ranking um like like from best in my opinion from like their best to their worst albums uh but I kind of wanted to do this one first and I, I like and they got some hits they they got like you know like uh you know kiss my kiss my dream um 1000 years uh i think their like one big hit off of it is we're more than machines or something like that i've only listened through it once and i like it it kind of reminds me of the kingdom a little bit uh which is what they're this is the follow-up record to, to the kingdom. Um, I think I like the kingdom maybe a little bit more, but this is a great record. It's really good. Uh, there's a lot of oomph behind it. Uh, again, I, Bush is one of my favorite bands. Well, they're my favorite band active today. They're one of my favorite bands of all time. And like I said, probably to the point of exhaustion, I think they're like the most underrated band. And I also kind of really dig the fact that I mean, like they have "Heavy as the Ocean." This is like a really good follow up to to the Kingdom, and I gotta find. I honestly, the, the the closest when I lived in New Jersey, there was like a record store maybe like twenty minutes away, um, but now like the, the closest record store from where I live now is like an hour, and I don't even know if they, I'd have to call and see if they even have, you know, um, uh, the 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 art of survival there you know because like that we're talking like a two-hour trip and i like to support you know like local record stores and everything but i'm this might be one where i might have to get it from amazon i don't know i, I we'll, we'll see about that i don't have the record yet um but i have listened to it online and it's it's really good either way i'm gonna get it i'm gonna support the band you know because i'm they deserve they deserve my support uh, but I just, I don't know where I'm going to get it or how I'm going to get it just quite yet. I mean, I could afford it. I don't know what's going to be like 15, 20 bucks. That's fine. But like, I just don't know how to go about it yet. And, you know, I, I think, I, I think it's, it's, you know, Gavin Rosdale, a lot of bands by this point in their music careers kind of, how do I put this? They, they kind of like live off of the past work that they've done you know like they don't really write new stuff they just kind of tore off of you know i mean like like i've said before you only have a certain amount of songs in you you know before to the point where it's just kind of like I, i've kind of given everything that, that that i have you know to, to, to music and i could just i'm just gonna kind of you know like lay off like rest on my on, on on the past of what i did bush is still going strong kevin rosdale is still writing an amazing songs and i really like this record i i do i have to listen to it i i i'm sorry i got the hiccups i have to li listen <laughs> to it again to really kind of figure out where where it stands and and i do plan on doing on doing a um um a ranking of of their records and i have a, you know, i am so sorry i like like you know some of their some of their records or all of their records 
from from and I'm a fan of all of them, but from what I think is their least best to their to their best. So uh, and I kind of ha am working on that, but I I, I want to listen to through to this record like a couple more times bef before I can even place it uh, in that record, but or in that uh, in that category. But it is kind of a culmination of like you know the kingdom. There's kind of some man on the run type stuff in there. Uh, there's some black and white rainbows kind of, may maybe a little bit of, of a vibe. So yeah, no, I mean, we'll, we'll um, I'll listen to it and again, and a couple times and then I'll, I'll give a ranking. So, I mean, what do you think if you saw the new uh, video what am I saying? The new video, the new, the new record of Bush. If, if you heard it, uh, you know, uh, I would love to, you know, love to hear your, your thoughts, drop a comment down in the section, uh, in the comment section. So yeah. Um, but I'm just, I'm happy that they're still going strong again. This is one of my favorite bands. So yeah, um, I'm, I'm pumped that they came out with something new. And I'm also, again, like kind of ashamed that like it took me a week to, to even make this video um it it should have been within like the first day that uh, you know uh, <laughs> i feel like i'm i let myself down but all right uh plenty of pepper everyone peace out bye